Daughter, if I told you that there is a football boot with zippers on, would you imagine what it looked like? I think it would have some zippers on. Just a wild guess. Just, oh, show me the box. Okay, People okay. want to see the boots okay. already. Under Armour Spotlight, brand new. Spoiler alert, it has a zipper. I haven't seen it, just for the record. There you go. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Okay, okay, let's just bring it to the people right away so they can experience this. Gonna pop the cherry, okay? It's not always easy, There you know? we go. Okay, that's... Football boot with a zipper. And laces. And laces. Um, so it looks like it's actually laceless, but it's not. It does have a zipper and... a special lace construction underneath. Now that's a pretty interesting thing. Because, you know, you would think that this is like a laceless thing and it looks pretty, it looks pretty neat. Obviously, this is their new spotlight. It takes over from this bad boy, which was a decent football boot. Once you broke soft. it in. It is very, very, Reminds very, me of the X. But softer, right? Yeah. Thinner you, and softer. You know, it's interesting with the, with the zipper, right? Because, yep. you know, they have actually done a good job covering it. Um, it's it's like a seam completely like it doesn't bulk out like you know when you have a jacket with with zipper Yes, you know, it's like hard and obviously I'm um, placing a zipper right here You know basically an area where you evidently gonna touch the ball at some point during the match you are yes um, That's how it is it's, it's okay. But I reckon they actually, you know, they did a good job actually hiding it um, it's Only problem is <laughs> that if you know, it's covered with this little Yes, uh, pieces of little synthetic. flap. Yes, like this. I think it's. Uh, if it you hit it there, it's gonna be a little. Should we say? It's gonna. It's gonna be in the way. That's just how it is. Yeah. You, you know, you can't have it all. You can't have your cake and eat it. So, so they decided to, you know, have the cake. I don't. I don't know. But they decided to have the zipper, obviously, so they don't end up in a situation like like you got with the X, where you have the lace cover, but you don't really have like it's just there. So when you put it on your foot, it it might seem a little loose somewhere. But, but that's what, what Under Armour wanted to avoid with the new Spotlight. So looking at the construction here, because as you said, it's pretty soft, but we actually, obviously, we have like the outer shell here, just like we know on the X. But then there's this inner um, neoprene sleeve-like thingy that has, it's like almost a three-piece construction, as you can uh, maybe see, there's like the outer yeah. sleeve here that has, the, that has the zipper on it. Then there's the, uh, Kind of like a thing that the laces are attached to that goes all the way to the bottom so it can really wrap your foot when you pull the laces tight. And then there is this uh, neoprene sock on the inside that really gives you this ni nice sock-like sensation. So it is, I mean, it's a three-piece construction, but it feels, I mean, obviously this is too big for us, but it feels... Move your eyes out of the way. <laughs> it feels pretty, it feels pretty, uh, you know... I need some, I need some close-up time, you know? Okay, okay, I'm gonna get it, give it to you. <laughs> Get a room, man. <laughs> but honestly, this upper, first impression. Super soft. It is know? soft. Very thick. You know, I'm, I'm actually very impressed. I, I really, it looks wide. First of all, yes. it looks like it's, oh, it's gonna stretch. Like, uh, you know, yes. you can stretch it with your fingers. Like, I don't know if Look the camera this. can this, catch it, but. This is Jolta size approved, right? The interesting thing, in my opinion here is, could, could I, you know, could they have done it without the zipper? Probably. Do you know what I mean? Like, yes. just go all in like this? Yes, <laughs> probably. Probably, but then again, you know, would, would, would they have the same amount of, like, would it be as close? Would, yes, would they be able that's to, the thing. To, to wrap it as closely uh, as, as it does? Because it, it is relatively, you know, tightly wrapped around the inner construction. Yeah. So, so that's what I think is pretty good. And then, actually, another thing I need to point out is, if you touch this, like the synthetic on the outside, it's very thin. It's very, very soft. Yes. I'm a bit afraid about the, you know, the stability uh, side of things. It almost feels like, you know, you can push your finger <laughs> through you, it. You, you can kind of see here if... There you go. Yeah. That's my fingers. Really Hopefully, thin. like, the inner uh, lace construction is going to take care of the stability and, and the lockdown. But, but, you know, apart from that, I think it actually feels pretty decent. Obviously, this is a big size and all, but, I mean... I'm not going to lie. I think this is my best ever hands-on experience with an Under Armour boots. I know you like your, you know. Yes, the previous spotlight. I like my clutch fits as well. The this, is, this is way, you know, stiffer. Yeah, I, I know, way I know. stiffer. 
And this has a kind of like, it, it looks a bit like some sort of, uh, a, almost like a carbon fiber, yeah. uh, glass fiber kind of thing to it, but it's very, very soft. Obviously also this, um, this SG version of this hybrid version of uh, the sole plate um, is from, uh, from the spotlight and the old spotlight. This is also a spotlight, but it's from the old spotlight. The FG plate, which we're gonna get a few images of in right here, is actually um, a brand new carbon plate that looks very, very interesting as well. Not that many studs, very stiff under the midfoot and obviously it's carbon fiber, so it's gonna be really responsive. Very interesting. And then, I think this is promising, you know? I know. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I know. I Under Armour are doing well. Really soft upper. Really you know? soft Only upper. Only thing I'm, I'm, you know, <laughs> I'm curious about is the, is the fact that there are, as you explained, you know, the three-piece yes. system. Like we have yes. the neoprene and then these little flaps on the side to give you probably some lockdown. Yes, I know. Um, and of course, this whole zipper swag. You know, the, the, <laughs> that's, that's what you can call, I mean, the zipper swag. Because, you know, it's, it's fun and all, but I mean, I'm just afraid, is it gonna work? What happens if the zipper breaks and all? You know, you know when you have a jacket and, yeah. and, and the zipper breaks and it's the yeah. most annoying thing in the world. And you know, you, it, it falls apart and it gets loose and you have to, you know, that, that's, I like the idea. I like the fact that you get a really, really clean striking surface here, mm -hmm. but it's just, you know, is it gonna make a difference compared to the X? I mean, I love the X, you know that. Me too. But, but, but you know, this is softer than the X, but is it gonna be better? I mean, jury's out. I'm gonna be excited to try it, but I think it looks really fresh and it has some potential. And you know, I'm, I'm especially, you know, I'm impressed by the fact that the, you know, the seam on yes. the on the zipper, mm -hmm. once it's closed, yes, it's completely like flat. Yes, like there is nothing. Obviously, you know, I don't know if the camera can catch it, but you know where the stitching goes around the zipper. There's a little bit of a hole. Yeah, right. Yes, but I don't think it's gonna do anything. But the because... zipper itself is very, it's very, uh, you know, low profile. Yes, that's pretty good. But but you know, just just looking at this, a football boot with a zipper, dude. <sighs> Now we've seen that, I mean, this is not gonna be the biggest innovation of 2017, obviously. No, but maybe it's gonna be a nice feature, you know? Like for wide-footed people, it's gonna be, first of all, easier to get in. Yes, right? then the um, X. Oh, and oh. then you, you tie the laces yes. and finish it off with closing the zipper. You know, I think, let's just put it like this. The upper is really soft. Mm -hmm. One of the softest mm -hmm. synthetics out there. You can already it's, say that's that. That's fair to say, yes. It's one of them. Yes. No, not, not like probably uh, Adam, uh, Adam bigger. Right. No. Uh, it's not that soft, but it's probably the second best. Yes. I, second I softest, really, yes. you know? Yes. Um, and if you can fit in perfectly, uh -huh. I think this could be something. I'm actually super excited to try this I out. Can, I can imagine. And, and the annoying thing with the X is that when you need to tie it, you know, getting your fingers down when you have it on yeah. your foot, that can be a nightmare. That's not gonna be a problem with the new spotlight. So, okay, if the zipper works, it's nice. If it doesn't, it's a bit of a catastrophe. But, but you know, it has some potential. I'm actually pretty excited about it. Me too. So, so let's just say, the jury's out. I'm excited. We're gonna but have to I, try this out. I can, actually, I can actually see this working. I can see this being a very good football boot. I agree. So who knows, who knows? But guys, what do you think? about the new Under Armour Spotlight. There's a flipping zipper on it. Is it gonna work? What do you think about the whole construction? You should let us know all your thoughts in the comment section below. And obviously, we're gonna try them out at some point to tell you if they actually fit you well. If they're Jolt or they wi -Fi. They should, they should. But we're gonna see. So again, let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe by hitting the green bubble over our heads. Leave us a like if you had a good time and Jolt, take it away. Share the video. That's it. With your friend. We're signing off. Cheerio. You already know. A zipper. A zipper. Damn. A zipper.